Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. In a short while, we will witness the capability demonstration of Manila Police District under the leadership of Police Brigadier General Vicente Dupadanao Jr., District Director, Manila Police District. As you have witnessed, the Chief TPU approaches the viewing stand and asks the permission of our Honorable Mayor Francisco Esco Moreno Domagoso to start the demonstration. And all ladies and gentlemen, presenting to you is the Manila Police District Bike Patrollers Team. They will now turn over the first obstacle, which is a slalom. This is a zigzag or wavy course between cones. It is spaced more closely to each other. They will navigate on their bike to an obstacle of cones without falling or putting down their feet up to the last biker. Ladies and gentlemen, this slalom, let us give our Manila Police District a big round of applause. Slowly, the obstacle will get difficult as we progress in our presentation in sequence. The slalom, the power slide, the power break, the balancing, and the ramp. Our second obstacle is the power slide. It is a technique where you can approach a corner on your bike at a high speed. Move around and turn as your bike tire loses traction with the ground. We're now on the third obstacle, the power brake. It is used to reduce the speed of the bicycle from high speed to a sudden stop. The power brake. Once again, a snappy power brake. Fourth obstacle, the balancing. It is the ability to maintain bodily equilibrium by making a turn on a tight space, taking everything into consideration. Your weight, the bike, the turn, and the space. Ladies and gentlemen, the snappiest MPD ramp. The ramp is 12 feet in length with a slope and a stairs. It has a 35 degree slope with 16 inches of width. Once again, a round of applause for a snappiest ramp. This wheel is a tight space when you're on top of a bicycle. Once again, our snappiest MPD ramp. When performing a ramp, it needs a firm hand to maneuver in this platform. You need to overcome your feel of falling body of, or first fist on the ground to cross this ramp smoothly. Once again, the snappiest and finest ramp. Ladies and gentlemen, that concludes our demonstration. We shall now proceed with the scenario. For the first scenario, a man suddenly grabs the shoulder bag of a lady. Walking on her way home, he immediately runs away after getting the bag. The victim rushed to get some help from the nearby bike patrollers. As a result, the bike patrollers immediately respond while the victim described the point and location where the suspect goes. As you can see, our bike patrollers successfully arrested the suspect, was able to inform him of his Miranda rights,
and will be brought to the nearest police station for proper disposition. Ladies and gentlemen, a successful case scenario. For the second scenario, a drunken man is shouting on top of his voice, challenging every passersby to a duel, thereby creating trouble in the area. On this scenario, our bike patrollers will make use of their bicycle as a shield. Here comes our bike patrollers evaluating the area. As you can see, our bike patroller use their bicycle as means of self-defense and as a weapon for those who refuse arrest. Viewing from here on the left side is the defensive aspect while on the right side is our bike patroller use the bicycle as a weapon. Once again, notifying the suspect of his Miranda doctrine during arrest is a basic for every police officer. Once again, a successful case scenario number two. For the third scenario, a drunken man holding a knife shouting on top of his voice, challenging every passersby to a duel, thereby creating trouble in the area. As you can see, ladies and gentlemen, our bike patroller drew his bike in order to divert the focus of the suspect from the police officers to the speeding bike towards him and disarm him for that purpose. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the third and last successful case scenario. From here, the Chief Tourist Police Unit will render the report that the capability demonstration has been concluded. Ladies and gentlemen, that ends the capability demonstration. Mabuhay ang lungsod ng Manila. This is your Manila Police District, your Manila's finest. Thank you very much and mabuhay.